<laughs> Let's get another check of weather this morning with John Schrabel, who's live in the Weather Center. Yesterday, I had a couple of high wind advisories. I just have one along the Altamont Pass. So as people are heading out this morning, is it going to be another windy day, a lot of sunshine mixed with the wind? <laughs> yeah, we're looking at a calmer day out there today, Raina, which is definitely nice change of pace from where we had been, especially two days ago when it was very windy all across the Bay Area. Obviously, as Raina noted, we still have that wind advisory on the Altamont Pass, so it's not completely calm, but we've worked our way significantly in the right direction. Right now, this is your view at San Francisco. Skies are clear enough. We're definitely not talking a foggy morning, not our windiest mornings either. So really good conditions as far as Mother Nature is concerned, as you do make your way out into the roadways this morning and eventually into work. Radar shows those dry conditions we've been holding on to for a while now and now high pressure has its time to shine as we work our way into the weekend ahead of us. Today we're still mild and that'll be the case tomorrow too but as that low gradually retreats to the east temperatures will really start to climb into the weekend. Winds as we noted are going to be calmer today still breezy at times but nothing like yesterday and especially not like Tuesday the day before it. Radar and Futurecast both lining up to show you another dry day today. We're going to be holding on to dry weather for the rest of the week, the weekend, and well into next week too. That is the big downside to the nice weather that we've been talking lately. We need to be talking rainfall, and that's just not something we've been tapping into. So while we may enjoy these conditions, it is definitely to note just how dry we were getting so early in the season. 50s and 60s for your daytime highs in San Francisco, and then elsewhere right along the coastline today. Montera and El Granada each at 55. Milbrae 62, South San Francisco right at 60 degrees. Further south on the peninsula, no 70s in San Carlos or Mountain View today like you saw yesterday, but with calmer winds and ample sunshine, it's all right. It's still going to be feeling pretty good. Low 70s for San Jose, Campbell up to Milpitas, while in the East Bay, temperatures range from the 60s to the 70s. Livermore at 71, Concord there too. Oakland, you'll be at 63. North Bay temps, very similar to yesterday's. Low uh, 70s for most spots and then a range of upper 60s once you get out into Marin and Sonoma counties. Tomorrow, temperatures don't change that much just yet. The big bump in temperatures comes Saturday, and that'll take us into our warmest day on Sunday. Both of these days will offer plentiful 80s, not just for our inland areas, but also right along the bay. And highs on Sunday climbing close, if not 290 degrees, for some of our furthest inland spots. Raina. John, thank you. All right, as you're hitting the road,